Hi everyone, this is Grace, how are you? You know, we would live up to age 100 and we would be working until age 80. So let's redesign your life. I believe the life is a long journey of self-discovery. Actually, we really don't know who we are, what we are, and it is our lifelong project to find out what we are, who we are, what we can do. And uh, everybody wants to become happy and uh, be rich. I believe there are three things you need to balance in order to be happy. Number one, love. You need to have a balance of love, good health, and money. The love includes your family love and the friendship. And after you know those three balance, and then everybody's different. So there are so many ways to find out your personality or personal trait. So you have to know about yourself, know thyself. And then number two, you have to work on your strength to advance further but also you need to know your weakness and you need to have the remedy. So today I'm talking about the remedy. So let's review quickly. Two days ago, when you are watching this video on YouTube, go back to my video collection and go for day 196, day 196. On that video, I briefly discuss there are four types of a personality, pink, green, orange, and blue. And uh, quickly, their personality is uh, pink is the person, action. Pink is an action person. Green is a people-oriented person. Orange is a time management person. And the blue is data oriented person. So let's give you an example. You know, I've been promoting this book since April of this year, 2018, because like you, I have tried so many, so many kinds of diets and uh, products, but so far, this is the only diet that really helped me to lose weight. As a matter of fact, in less than five months, I have lost 17 pounds. My father lost almost 20 pounds. And uh, the beauty of this diet is you don't have to buy extra products like a protein shake or anything. All you have to do is just make a copy of the food to eat, food to avoid from this book. Just make a Xerox copy and carry it with you when you go grocery shopping. So basically, it doesn't cost you anything extra. You just change the food you buy from one kind of food to the other kind of food, which is called lectin-free. But anyhow, so when I say, try this, it really works. There are four kinds of personality, right? So the pink person, just like me, I learned about this book very briefly, and I got the inspiration. I got aha moment. I said, aha, I love the theory behind. I know I'm an intuitive person. I know it's going to work for me. So the minute I read this book, I'm already out there grocery shopping. On from the same day, I'm on this lectin-free diet, and I lost 17 pounds. Now, this green person, green person is different. She wouldn't do anything until maybe her friend tries it. Then she's okay, if so-and-so does it, I'll do it. You know, so for the green person to initiate something, she needs to have some friends take her hands and walk through. Now, blue person, totally opposite from me. Me, pink person, is a person of massive action, intuitive. Blue person is the kind of person likes to research, 
study the evidence, study all the paperwork. So if I talk to a green person, a blue person, and I recommend, try this. You know what blue person would do? She would Google the title. She would read every single review about this book. They, she would search lectin-free diet research paper. Blue is the kind of person they would read everything. They would read you know, every page of owner's manual before they start using it. Whereas red person would be like an iPhone, you know, those uh, Apple product. No owner's manual. Everything is intuitive. That's pink. So blue is totally opposite. Now, this orange person, orange person is for orange people, time is so important. So me, pink person, I'm going to try right away. As a matter of fact, it was April 10. I learned about this. April 10, I start the program. Blue person, I gave them the book link. I told them about the story. Still today, five months later, still blue person is researching. Every time I see blue person, hey, are you on a diet? She said, oh no, Grace, I have a question. Which kind of bean can you eat, can you, can you not eat? I said, I already told you many times. This person, very slow to initiate something. And then the green person, after I try it, I say, you have to do this, have to, this is so good, this is so good. Green person doesn't care about reading. Green person would try saying because, because Grace told me to do this, because Grace said this is great. That's what the green person is. Now the orange person, I say, hey, read this book, this is good. And that was April 10, right? Orange person said, well, Grace, it's in the middle of April. Let's wait. Let me see. I will start reading the book on uh, May 1st. Or orange person say, ah, oh, you know, now it's uh, April toward the end of the school year. It's busy. Let me take that book with me when we go out on the vacation. You know, something like that. So the orange people, timing is so important. And again, as I said, you are not 100% of one kind. You are the mixture of this, but you do have one kind that is more prominent. Let's say like me, maybe 80%, I'm pink. But another uh, maybe 10%, maybe timing. And then 5% blue, another 5% oh, no, green, something like that. So you are a mixture of this. And also number two, please remember, there's no good or bad. You know, I'm not saying pink is always good, blue is always slow. No, I'm not saying that. There's always a strength and a weakness. So all you have to know is you know yourself, know your strength, know your weakness. So today I'm talking about remedy for green person. If you are blue, that's yesterday I already covered it, okay? So today the green person, again, it's always strength and weakness. The strength of green person is a team player, people oriented. So they are very attentive to people's needs. This person will be very good to build a good organization because she or he can feel what other people are feeling about the project or job or business or whatever. So this person is a very good people-oriented leader. However, yin and yang, right? Law of yin and yang. Your strength can be your weakness because green person is so people-oriented. Sometimes, they cannot be assertive. They tend to be a good listener and they like to be servant leader and they become secondary in terms of their priority hierarchy. Or they would prioritize team goal or consensus more than what he or she personally feels. So that's your weakness. 
And because of that, and you like to take the consensus, you are a very democratic person. So your weakness would be because the way you do, you could miss a big opportunity. Because, you know, let's say there is a one big opportunity just knocking on your door. But here you are, let the person intuitive jump on it right away. And the green person, you would call around. Maybe you might have a family meeting or you might have board of trustee meeting, whatever. And you would try to take a consensus. You would like to get unanimous agreement before you take action. And uh, perhaps because you don't feel confident as a decision maker, or perhaps you don't want to take 100% responsibility for the outcome, for the negative outcome especially. You might say, yeah, because you agree with me. You said it's a good idea. Perhaps, perhaps, I'm not saying you could be, but maybe perhaps that's why you cannot be like a red person. No matter what everybody say, I'm going. That's the pink person, person of action. But the you, green person, maybe. So what the remedy for you, number one, you have to realize opportunity comes once, once in your lifetime. The one, the opportunity just come to you it could be your life-changing opportunity. So take the courage, go for it. And number two, be responsible for the outcome. You know, if you try to take a consensus, in other words, you, that's a kind of person you don't wanna take responsibility or you don't feel confident about your knowledge. You don't feel confident about the outcome you can deliver. So if you are the green person, you know, it's good to be people oriented. It's good to be sensitive to other people's feeling. However, there is a time you have to be firm about your ability, capability. Sometimes you really have to be a firm leader. And then sometimes don't worry about what other people would react to you, what people might think. Because as I always say, you have to know, you have to be clear about what you can change, what you cannot change. You can change your behavior today, you can change your future, but you cannot, you cannot change other people. It's not your business what other people think about you, whether or not they would agree with you, they, whether or not they would support you. So if you are the green person, remedy for you, number one, believe you can do it. Build up your self-confidence and have a courage to take 100% responsibility for the outcome. Okay, that's all for today. So tomorrow, I'm not sure I'm going to talk about pink or orange. So stay tuned. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.